Okay, hello guys. So, it's Marcos Vlog here. So, in this video, so I'm going to teach you the song by Dua Lipa. And the name of the song is uh, Levi Tate. Okay, so let's start. So, in this uh, song, basically it has three chords. Okay, so basically we will start with A minor. Okay, as you can see here. Okay. So basically, so I bring my second finger here. Okay. So the next is uh, this finger here. So the second finger would be on uh, second fret fourth string, and then followed by ring finger, which is third finger, on third string, second fret, and then at the back, which is the first finger, on second string, first fret. And then basically we'll start st strumming from the fifth string. Okay. So basically the song has, uh, I mean, each chord has four counts. Okay. One, two, three, four. And then next chord is, would be the E minor. So this one. Two. Three, four, and then followed by D minor, just this. Okay, so D minor. Okay, so look at the the fingering positions. So I put the first finger here, in first string, first fret on capo. Okay, well actually, this song is. Uh, we need to capo the, the neck at 2nd fret as you can see here yeah okay okay so let's continue so so on the minor so so basically i i press this one with uh, this this string first string with my first finger first fret and then followed by second finger third string second fret on capo and then last last one is third finger second string third fret then we'll start from fourth string okay so that is four counts as well okay so you just make sure you count evenly all right so it's like one two three four So basically that's it, huh? but on the on the song, so basically it's uh, it's two counts. Okay, so it's like one two, one two, one two, one two. So the reason why I I uh, used to count it as four because I want you to be good at the. You know, because I want you to search, uh, check the fingers if it's wrong or not, if it's correct or not. Okay, because the switching is actually the challenging part. Okay, so this is the the actual song. So it's one, two. Okay, it's the beat. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two. Okay, and then the strumming would be like this. So it's like down, up, down, up, down, up. Again, so down, up, down, up, down, up. Okay, I'll play it huh? with the chords. So down, up, down, up, down, up. Okay, next is E minor, down. Next is D minor, down, up, down, up, down, up, and then A minor, down, up, down, up, down, up. Then you play it again for the next set of uh, 
chords or we call it chord progression so again so <laughs> Basically, that's how it sounds. Okay, so so make sure you you bring all your fingers into proper place, ah, huh? so, into proper strings, uh, positions like on the strings and as well as at the frets. Okay, and then make sure you your your fingers are curved and uh, stiff like this. Yeah, so A minor, I did not use this one, huh? so I only be laying, I only be using uh, where these three, okay? So E minor is this, okay, As you can see, you see, huh? without this, use only two fingers there on, on, uh, on top. So between fifth string and fourth string. Then you start from E. Okay. Then D minor. D minor. Yeah. So we'll start from uh, D string or fourth string. And then A minor. So start from the A string or fifth string. Alright, okay, so guys, so until next time, so hope you love this video, and then if you think this video uh, was helpful, so can you just please uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel, so just click the uh, all, huh? just all notification bell, so you'll be updated for, for more videos to come. Okay, so once again, this is Marcos Vlog saying goodbye and stay safe.